Hey guys, what's going on? <clears throat> Big Daddy here. So right now my boy, uh, Michael and I are running the Cannes Sanctuary. And this Amazon's actually wearing Windforce now. It's been the argument of the century. Yeah, which is better, you know, faith or Windforce? I came into this Path of Diablo thinking, oh shit, look at this. <clears throat> look at that, that's a great pole axe. Uh, yeah, got a cube socket, that thing. But, Windforce, I mean, it's a toad, bro. You know, it really is, but beyond that, I mean, Faith is a tough comparison from what we've been finding. Or what I've been finding. And I gotta, I'm gonna make a comprehensive video about this shit, alright? In fact, it was supposed to be this video, now that I think of it. But I invited my boy right here to run, so, you know. He uh, just started playing. Check this out. He's level 80. And using Eagle Horn right now. Now I need to make a video where I'm wielding Eagle Horn. I could easily get one, actually. I asked him if I could, uh, you know, use it for a minute. But, I mean, truth is, man, they're so damn cheap. I mean, maybe I should even spread the word how cheap they are. I guess the prices might go up. More people might want them. But I doubt that, because Eagle Horn seems to be an underrated bow, especially now in Path of Diablo where you can get six socketed Eagle Horn and six socketed Wind Force. And what he's finding with his character, especially early on, he just started using this Eagle Horn like, I don't know, he's like level 75 or something, 76. It was a drastic difference, bro. And I had a feeling it might be, <clears throat> you see, because he was using Barizza that badass crossbow but the problem was he wasn't hitting like every single damn time obviously he's not you know at a low level it's hard as hell to hit like crazy you know he had like a 70 percent 75 percent attack rating something like that chance to hit so even though he took a decent hit in damage uh going from barizza to eagle horn he noticed a vast improvement. And plus, we're both using Atmos Amulet. Alright. So we cast amp damage like crazy, Brett. Look what Ice Daddy does here. He uh, blasts magic arrow at the physical immunes. Uh, my boy Michael here, though, he said he just blasts them like a man out of hell with, I don't know, strafe or something. And just waiting for, you know, amp damage to proc. Which, it procs like crazy. And he took notice to that as well. You know, when your bow is hitting every damn time, you're procking a lot of amp damage with Atmos Amulet. I mean, I think this amulet right here is underlooked. <clears throat> Just like Eagle Horn. So you check this out. Here's the, here's the gear. Now, I'm going to make a video where I compare Faith and Wind Force, alright? Now, this isn't like an optimal Wind Force. It's only three sockets. And yeah, I put shells in it. I had to hit the fucking breakpoint, bro, okay? Trust me, if I don't hit that shit, this character is going to kill, like, half the speed. I mean, shit, I'll make a video on that, too, for all you doubters. You know, I'll show you how much of a fucking slug Windforce is when you attack slow as a slug. It's not desirable. Hmm. Yeah, I got a sock at this thing, man. I'm looking forward to that. Hoping to get 40s out of that. But I mean, hell, when I started recording this video, I forgot it was Jordan Windforce, but here we are. And as you can see, I mean, it's performing all right, but I got to make a video where I run the chaos once with uh, Windforce and once with Faith. And I think you guys are going to be seeing that uh, it's not all what it's cracked up to be. In fact, for a little while, I was thinking Windforce uh, is a fraud, you know, uh, the six socketed Windforce. I mean, I wanted to like it, man. Because it's old school Diablo 1 nostalgia. Same with Eaglehorn. But I'm starting to come back around again. You know, thinking, eh, maybe Iceman, if you get Wind Force on your character, six socketed one, or even this one for that matter, because I think you're only going to need three shells in it to hit the final attack speed breakpoint. If you do that, and if you have faith on your Merc, uh, you might, uh, it, it, it might be worth the difference there because uh, if you hit you know we're gonna have to check the breakpoints I might actually ask my boy here to uh, hold the faith so I can get 
the what would be then seemingly the Merc aura, if I were to put faith on the Aquan Merc, and we'll see how that goes. But Path of Diablos, it's a good way to go, man. This is the way to play Diablo, it seems. And my boy here is really liking it. He and I both, you know, came into this really late. We'll let him have that little essence if he wants it. He probably just ain't wanted to take shit because, oh shit, look at that. It's Hellforge plate. That's Nadge's. That's a pretty nice armor, man. Says GG1. <laughs> Yeah, he's liking that Ignore's target's defense, man. It seems like he's starting to discover that that shit is whack. It's true. I mean, that's why, you know, I wanted him to use Eaglehorn, because I thought... Um, I thought he'd, you know, find a liking to that. Especially at early levels. So let's see how the Faith does when he equips it, actually. Because I'm starting to think, you know, maybe it'd be a good way to go. Oh, shit. Yeah, there's a Zeagle Horn on the ground. Oh, right. He just tossed it there for a minute. Okay, so we'll go outside of town. Because I really want to see the difference. Uh, it should take, because I'm at one, I'm at, you know, 147 IES. I'm beyond that break point with Windforce Hydrobosi. It's at, uh, oh, shit, it's 99. Oh, right. Okay. Back to Windforce. It's 165. So he'll wear this. And here I am without it. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And now he'll come out with a face. Oh, shit. Needs one dex. I'll just give him uh, my Raven Frost. I mean, this could be really telling, man. You know, this could be really telling. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, oh fuck, look at that. Five, six. Holy shit! Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. <laughs> John Wick. Dude, I heard that movie's pretty tight. <clears throat> I haven't seen that movie, though. But uh, I kind of want to watch it. I mean, there are two of them, right? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think it's going to be the same. Um, damn, dude, that is fast as fuck. Okay, let's see what happens when I take off the gloves. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think it's the same. I think it's the same. Let's check this out. Okay, so right now, I'm at 165. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Take off the gloves. Now I'm at 135. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. What the fuck? Is it the same? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. It's the same. What did it win for us? Yeah, that would be GG. With Ja, Ohm, Ohm, or whatever. I mean, I might not even... I'm going to use his if he lets me. And um, see what this is like without all the shells. Four, four times S runes equals Ja. <laughs> what the fuck? <clears throat> oh, right, right, right. Yeah, I knew that there was some something nice about those Eths or Elds or something. Uh, yeah, that's a really interesting question because I was wondering how well that would perform when you do the negative percent target defense. And, bro, uh, I'm assuming you're going to watch this video, man. Uh, the thing is with that, you probably know this, the good thing about the negative percent uh, enemy defense is that that also applies to bosses and champions and shit unlike uh, unlike you know the ignores targets defense 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 it's the same 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 it's the same 
Holy shit! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Are you fucking serious? Dude, it's it's fast as hell. Dude, that takes you like sky high, man, with uh, attack speed. Don't even need laying of hands. Alright. Alright, that's I mean I could test this more thoroughly, but. Alright, well, anyway, <clears throat> yeah, I know this wasn't the most, like, in-depth video or whatever, but I kind of wanted to blah, 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 that shit for a minute, but I'm going to do a comprehensive video, okay, so stay tuned. This video is going to be tight. It's going to have all sorts of mathematics and shit, and it's going to be very entertaining, so stay tuned for that comprehensive, you know, comparison, all right? And like this damn video, become a patron if you want, and thank you to my patrons. And for all the support you guys are giving me. A couple donations on the PayPal tip jar, man. I spent really liking that. But more than anything, man, the subscribers, the views, me want more. So like the damn video and spread the word, bruh. Peace be with you.